Hi guys, so I'm back today with another thrift haul. So everything I've thrifted this week will be shown to you today. So I'm a full-time reseller on the Poshmark app and my name is Perline, but I go by Stunning for Less on the Poshmark app. And I usually come here and show you my thrift haul so you can see what treasures can be found if you go to the thrift store and also if you see something that you like and would like to purchase you just follow the link in my description that will send you to my closet where everything will be listed and you'll be able to buy, to purchase the item also this channel is basically reselling so every tips every tricks i'm working on some videos about reselling the reselling process and how to choose um the items that you are supposed to be selling that will give you more money also the brands and everything so i'm working on it so just be a little bit patient with me i'll come up with great content for you guys so if you are new to the channel welcome um and make yourself at ease enjoy the video and don't forget to subscribe if you are just passing by have a great day and let's get into the video okay so today i have a lot of shoes so this week in particular i went to different stores i went to the goodwill outlet i went to um the buffalo exchange outlet i went to the family thrift store outlet here in san antonio and i also purchased from someone um basically i met i saw an ad on facebook marketplace and that woman was selling some of her shoes and when i saw the shoes on the picture some of them really you know i was like i can make some money from that so i went and grabbed it from her and i paid her of course but it was a great deal that she gave so i'm going to show you first the the shoes the shoes that i got i got a lot of shoes and also i have some clothes i don't have much clothes today to show but i'm going to go very fast so that will not waste time okay so number one is this those are sneakers with you know chunky heels platform heels and this is the bottom franco sarto i'm going to clean a little bit the bottom before franco sarto they are franco sarto and then the the size is eight medium and it's a fabric upper and I really like it. If it was my size, I would have kept this, but it is not my size. So I'm, I have to sell it. But this one, I'm expecting to make um, something like $45 on those. Yes, that's my expectation because, the, because of the comps that I checked. So this. Oh, the first one I got it at the Buffalo Exchange outlet. This is the pair, one of the pair that I got from that woman on Facebook Marketplace. This is a pair of Hog Australia. And this is so in excellent condition. Basically, she didn't wear those things. She explained to me that she got pregnant and then she stopped going to work and then she wasn't working. So she didn't have to wear all those shoes anymore. And that's the reason why she's getting rid of those because it doesn't fit her anymore anyway. So yeah, I got this in a, at a very good price. It was like, she did, um, she sold, I don't remember, but it, it was a good, a good bargain. Yeah. So this is it from that woman. Another one that I found from her, another one was this one, those boots from Keen. This is Keen boots, winter boots. Never, I think she didn't even wear these ones as well. It's, the traction's perfect. She didn't even wear those boots. This is from Keen, in excellent condition. So the hug for, I'm sorry, I didn't put, this one is already on my Poshmark closet. I already posted it. It's a size eight. So everything she sold was eight, I believe. So this Keen has that, you know, you already know it's, it warms up inside so it keeps your feet very warm and um, the size is a size us8 as i said so yeah 
in excellent condition, keen. And this one will be posted. The other one is already posted, but this one I have not gotten a chance to post it yet, but I'll do it. Yeah, so for the UGG, I think I'll sell it for somewhere around 125 because they, they are in excellent condition. She didn't really wear it. So 125 that's what I'm expecting. And from this, for this skin, I think the same, 125 also. That's what I'm expecting. And next up, this one, I got it at the thrift store. It's a Texas thrift store. So I went there and I got those skin again. I thought it was nice. It was like new. The attractions are in perfect condition and the insides perfect. It's actually in perfect condition. Everything is perfect on this. So I'm expecting something like uh, 65 to $70 for those. Um, and it's a size 8.5 for those skin. Very good for hiking. Those are hiking shoes. Another boots that I got at that Texas is this. This is like a maroon. Those are clocks. Those are booties. And I really like this, um, the heels, because it's, it wasn't much used, you know? And it's a great, 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 great boot for every day. Let me see the size. The size is nine and a half medium, and it's a leather upper, and it's a Clark's. So this one, I'm expecting, I think, 55. 55 for those boots because they are in great condition. No flows. Okay, next up will be this. Um, this one, I got them at the Buffalo Exchange Outlet. I love this store because... I get so many good stuff over there for great prices. Look, this is brand new. The person, nobody wore that. It's brand new. So this is going for $80, I think. I think it's $80. And this one is a size. This one is already posted on my, on my Pushmark closet. But let me see the size, okay? trying to find the size eight and a half medium as well so i've been showing a lot of eights eight eight and a half eight this is a great size to sell though eight eight and a half a lot of people are eight and a half the color is like a maroon it's really nice i really like it but it's not my size as usual <laughs> so next up is this this is so cute those are open toes booties from Joe's Jeans. Joe's. Everybody knows Joe's. <laughs> so yeah, I think inch, this one is 3.5 inch approximately. And as you can see, this one opens up over here so you can easily wear them in perfect condition as well. It's a size 11. And this one fits me actually and it looks so good on me. I'm a size 10. So the 11 still fits, and that's the bottom. So as I said, very likely used if it, if it was used, because most of them are just uh, stickers. So, and the color is kind of a gray. Yeah, and this one I'm expecting 80, 80 dollars because they are new like new okay so next up let's go I'm trying to go very fast here so this ones are vents Kamuto. this is the marlo and it's a size 8 medium in great condition i love shoes with those details the zip in front with the cut out sides and it has another zipper in the back this is a four inch heel and it's in excellent condition it was used though so this one, I'm expecting something like 50 for this one because it's in great condition. I make sure I purchase stuff that are in excellent condition, like like almost new. Um, but sometimes you can have some wear 
uh, on the sole. I um, pay attention to everything. I like to pick up leather upper. It can have some, some little scratches, but not big, big, big problems on the shoe. Yes, I pay attention to that. I don't want to just grab anything. So those are a pair of LK Bennett's. And this one, I didn't know LK Bennett's, but when I touched those shoes, this one was from the Buffalo Exchange. And when I touched the shoes, I knew it was quality. So I just grabbed them. And this one is a size 36 and a half, made in Spain, real leather, and it's LK. And you can see it wasn't really used. It's in excellent condition. And LK been at 36.5, so I think it's a US 6.5 6 or maybe 7 because it looks a kind of big for a 6.5. So, next up, now we are going to the smaller sizes because I got some small size. Everybody needs to have something. So, this one, I really like them. I've never found any Fly London before. Those are excellent condition. When you touch it, the leather, you know it's real. It's a size 36, Fly London, in great, great, great condition. You see a lot of tractions, and the shoe is in excellent condition. The leather, great. The inside, great. Everything. So this one, I think 100 and somewhere in the run, in the 100-ish. That's what I'm expecting for this. Next up is this pair of mm, Born, and this is so cute. I really like the orange color, the straps, and everything. This one is a uh, leather upper and lining, and it's a size 7, 738. So, yeah, excellent condition. And those, I found them at the Goodwill bin. I was really surprised because I went I kind of early when it was opening, so... Yep, as you can see, it's like new. It wasn't really, it wasn't worn. So this one may be expecting something like 40, 45 for them. Um, because it's in excellent condition. And yeah, 40, 45. That would be fine. For the next up is this pair of flats. I still take flats because some people wear flats. I'm thinking about everybody. So this one is Steven by Steve Madden, and it's a clone. That's the name of the model. And it's a size six and a half medium, leather upper, synthetic lining. And as you can see, in excellent condition. The back, the front, everything is in perfect condition. It was worn, but you know, slightly in great condition. So this one I'm expecting like 35 to 40 dollars for them. I usually don't buy stuff that uh, that sell for cheap, so that's why you think that my my prices may be a little high. But people still buy it because they know the they know the quality and the name brands, you know, that I'm selling. So next up are this pair of flats from Diane von Furstenberg, but that's a size five. I don't carry a lot of size five in my closet, maybe three or four shoes. But I'm like, we have to think of people who have small feet, small, you know, small. <laughs> so this is the Paris. The name is Paris. The name of this sandal is Paris. It's a U.S. 5 medium. And uh, the cost is still down here, $228. So it's a pretty expensive pair. Great condition, still in perfect condition. Uh, some signs of wear, but not a lot. You know that that person didn't really wear the shoes. And... That's the inside, Diane Fawn first, Fawn, Fawn first, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> so yes, so it has those laces so you can lace it up. It's really nice, but that's not my size. It's a size five medium, so yeah, it'll be. I think this is already posted on my channel and I'm expecting somewhere like $70 for that. It's in great condition. Another one, this is a pair of Seychelles flats. This, I told you I'm at the smallish, small, small sizes right now. So this one is a pair of Seychelles, open here and open at the front. Very nice um, Seychelles. And the size is six and a half, and it's a leather upper and leather and soft line, 
leather sock and lining and that's the bottom it wasn't really used this is just you know the stickers that I removed from down here but as you can see in great condition black leather size six and a half medium and this one I'm expecting something like 65 for them because as I said 60 between 50 to 65 but I will not say no to 45 this is just approximate expectation and next up are this Zara sandals three inch heels and this is a size 40 if I remember yes it's a size 40 and this is so comfortable and this is cute basically not really used in good condition this one maybe 40 45 for those Zara maybe I don't know I've never sold this particular one before so next this one I need to clean a little bit the sole and the you know the white part but those I couldn't let it behind I couldn't leave those shoes behind because of the color the tie-dye and the color is so beautiful even if you wear all black all white whatever you want to wear is going to look fly on with those sneakers from BP and those are a size 9 medium is the BP Sony fab fabric upper fabric and PU lining and uh, yeah nine 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 so I don't know maybe it can fit me if it does I'll just I don't know so I'm going to post this maybe for $40 $40 45 so if you're interested this will be up there by tomorrow I hope so because I've already been listing a lot of them I don't think I posted this yet okay so next up Buffalo Exchange this is a pair of 80 Bauer um, loafers in excellent condition as you can see like don't even know if they used it I don't think they used it um, leather as you know leather upper it's a woman size 11 balance man made material made in China this doesn't fit me, but I really like those kind of shoes. So this Eddie Bauer will be up maybe for 40, 45. So I really like very big sizes because, you know, I feel like they don't really have a lot of shoes out there. So I try to grab a lot of 11, 12, and also the small size, five, six, six and a half. I have a lot of nine, eight, seven in my closet. So. Those are kind of nice to have. Those are a pair, basic black pump, three and a half or four inch heels. Antonio Melani. It's, those are leather upper and it's the name is Kindle. Kindle or Kindle. And it's a size eight and a half medium. As I said, she didn't really, I got it from that woman. She didn't really wear them, as you can see. Excellent condition. Excellent condition. And it's a size eight and a half medium leather upper, Antonio Melani. And it will be up all my closet. This is a pair of classic pumps. So this one may be 55. It's in excellent condition, like new. She didn't use it, as she told me. Next. Um, we have this pair of Antonio Melani again. This is this woman. I think she really loves Antonio Melani. So this, those are black patent, open toe pumps, four inch heels in excellent condition as well. I don't think she even got a chance to wear them as much. As you can see, it's in great condition. It's a size eight and a half medium and patent leather. And I don't see the model. The model, I can't see. So yeah, leather upper leather lining in excellent condition. Antonio Milani, size eight and a half, medium. So next up, we have this from that same woman. 
those are a pair of open toe heels from micro micro course great condition just this little scratch over here but it's a micro course size seven and a half medium from that same woman i told you excellent condition in the front the inside i don't think she really wore that so i'm going to this one will go for 55 60 at the most next up is this aldo's this is five inch five five and a half inch aldo's made in brazil this was i think i grabbed those at the thrift store family thrift store outlet if i remember and this is a size eight and a half this is so beautiful oh my god but that's not my size it's so in great condition and it's so so nice um a little scuff but it's not big deals you know it's like really slight cuffs um on the heels but it's in great condition this is great condition i'm going to list them for 45 45 oh i'm expecting 45 from those maybe not if you go and you see the listing is a little higher don't forget that it's Poshmark and we are we can either send offers or so I need to leave room for offers as well. But those shoes, those shoes, eight and a half. Who are those made in Brazil? The quality is bomb. Okay, so next up is this pair of Steve Madden um trooper i love selling this i have a lot on, on my closet so i have to release them because i listed them a long time ago when it was summertime because every time i see those i buy them because people buy it a lot so this one usually i sell them between 45 and 50 um 45 and 60 dollars um depending on the season if someone buys it for example in the middle of the summer i'll give him a little bit of grace and give him even um, some a cheaper price. So those are a, um, Steve Madden Trooper combat boots. And I think the size is eight medium. This is from that same woman, as I said. She didn't use those shoes. So this was in great, this is in great I just need to clean a little bit here, but she didn't really use it. It's in perfect condition because I've bought a lot of them at the thrift store. So I know some of them was really worn and I sold them for 45. So this one is not really worn. The, the heels are really in great condition still. So just cleaning a little bit of the thing and it's great, it's in great condition, size eight, Steve Madden Trooper. So this will be posted there maybe for 65. And uh, we'll see, we'll go from there. Those, I bought them because they were cute. <laughs> yes, I really, really loved the shoes. It's so beautiful. Look at that. And it was in perfect condition. Sorry, it fell. Look at it. That person didn't even wear the shoes. Look, it's an incline too. Made leather. And it's made in Italy. And it's a size like six medium. It's in perfect condition. Perfect. I, like, I've never seen such good quality shoes from Ancline before. And this one, seriously, if you can grab it, just grab it. It's a size six medium. In excellent condition excellent condition I'll buy I'll put it for $100 because those are rare those are great quality in perfect condition so yes $100 for those six medium I'm expecting $100 I might put it a little higher on the price those I need to clean basically this I bought it and I was like I'm just going to put it there if someone wants to buy it in, in the condition they are in good so I might put it for $25 those are uh, Bagley Mishka um, satin top um, sneakers with this oh the crystal was so in it's like so beautiful one of them was like starting to detach but I'm just going to grow it back so don't worry about it but like it's in great condition some little things because it's fabric upper yeah, it will need maybe more, a little bit of cleaning, but I think it's in great condition. Bagley Mishka, and this one's very good condition. It's not like this one couldn't stay there, and yeah, maybe I'll put it for twenty-five dollars. 
You see the inside? It's in great condition. Maybe 20, 20, 25 to 30 dollars for those. The person needs to clean it though, because those are really expensive shoes. So it's up to you. If you want it, you buy. Okay. And the last one that I almost forgot. Sorry. This is the last one. Those are a pair of Lucky Brands booties. The only thing is this pink, white pants over here. I don't know where, where it came from, but yeah. So those are four inch stack heels, booties. It's, it's slip on, Lucky Brain. And I think the size was nine and a half. And that's the bottom. It's like new. It's new, basically, it's new. It wasn't used. It's new. Those are new. Um, 9.5 medium, as I said, Lucky Brands. Beautiful booties. I really like this detail over here. This is so cute. But just remember, there's that little white thing. I don't know if you guys can remove it. If you can, just buy it by star like new and this one i'm expecting 80 dollars and that's it for the shoes oh my god that was a lot okay let's go to some of the clothes that i had that needs to be posted and i'm just dragging because it's close and it takes a lot of time to photograph and yeah those are zara it's a top us small organza tie and sweater here with the cuff this is a black nice you can just tie this one it's in great condition this is a zara sweater and organza mixed black size small second up is this um sweater from tommy Tommy ear finger and um, I bought it at the clove mentor it's gray stripes we have some buttons and just the name and it's in excellent condition and this is Tommy I think size medium uh, yeah Clove Mentor. I, I stopped at the Clove Mentor this, this week. Okay, so next up is this um, white distressed or destroyed. I don't even know if how to call it. But that's the a sweater, a white sweater from Free People. Three people and it's a size medium so yeah size medium destroyed or distressed <laughs> in some parts this is intentional okay size medium next up is this vintage Tommy and finger they, it, they call it new vintage Tommy a finger and it has that big thing over here and Tommy a finger jeans size 4 100% cotton and it's a cropped boyfriend 25 inch new vintage size 4 so yeah it's cropped so that's how it looks in the back and then that's the front and you yeah, have that to me I think thingy size four. I'll try to post it as soon as possible. Okay, so next up is another pair of jeans. It's a med made well, made well jeans. Um it's a 2019 style, and the name of the style is the perfect vintage crop jean and it's a size 25 um, and it's distressed 
one of the sides is distressed and the hem is not raw but it's a little raw so you have some things going on at the hem as well so distressed here and yeah I rise made well size 25 next up so this this one I found at the Buffalo Exchange this one I paid up for it um, it was $14 so 91 so $15 but it's a rock revival and the model is Rosaline boots and it's a size 29 very beautiful I really like the the back and the front everything is in perfect condition that's why I grabbed it for that much I had to pay up but it's okay rock revival boots Rosaline boots so this will be up on my closet as well size 29 the next up is this I don't even know it's new with that brave soul London I have to look it up brave soul and they say size 1240 but the problem is it doesn't fit the size 1240 no because it, I think it has no, there's no um, stretch. It has raw hem. This is um, Brave Soul London denim, brand new with tag. So if you know something about these brands, just put it in the comments. It's a mom jeans, mom jeans, and that's all I have as information but that size 12 is misleading except if it's a, maybe it's a UK size 12 so maybe size 8 US I have to check it out I don't know how much I'm going to take this one and the last one for the video oh I'm tired I don't know how people do one hour haul I'm 32 minutes Jeez. Blank NYC size 29, and it's the skinny black with um, lace on the side. Very simple but nice. Blank NYC, you can see over here. And it's a size 29. Alrighty, so that's it for the haul. So if you saw anything that you really like, please don't forget. I'm going to leave my link below. If you have any question uh, on how I pick those things when I go to the store, just leave your, your question below, whatever you want to ask me concerning um, how to purchase stuff and resell it online and how to make profit because this is a question that people ask themselves before they you know go into the business. So yes. That's it for the video and I'll see you next time with another haul and I'm, as I said, I'm working on more content, um, the reselling side of the business. So just bear with me a little bit and if it's ready, we're going to have more. Have an excellent morning and day wherever you are and I'll see you next time. Bye.